day 11 of the Trans-Canada Highway trip and today we're on the leg that goes from Winnipeg in Manitoba across to Yorkton. Now we've decided to do a slightly different route today uh, as opposed to the point to point. So we've gone from Manitoba, sorry, going from Winnipeg in Manitoba up to a place called the Narrows which is um, part of the Lake Manitoba area and it's a causeway that goes from the east side to the west side and then we're going to go off to Yorkton from there at about uh, 30 miles about half an hour to the trip now the reason I'm stopping here apart from to look at that uh, wonderful FJR is that we are now approaching the prairies and this particular point illustrates beautifully what we're going to see when we get to the prairies because what you'll see as I pan round is not an awful lot. There's a bit of vegetation. In that direction, you can see a road going on as far as the eye can see. There is a car in the distance, just one off. I'm going to pan round. There's more low level vegetation. As we pan round, you'll see the road in the other direction, as far as the eye can see. Now, we've been along this road, it must, have, must be about 10 miles long, totally straight. We've seen about two or three cars, but this is an indication of what the prairies are like. Um, when we get to Prairie World, in either a few hours' time or tomorrow morning, I'll take another picture on the second of the video because what you'll see then is vegetation at a very low level and it really illustrates why they call this area the area of the big sky. But I'll just turn around again and it's a beautiful blue sky today, nice and sunny and warm, but you, you can just see the sky wall to wall. It's, it's quite something. But, but, but look at that, look down the road there. It's like a scene out of the movies. Uh, so yeah, we've got about four hours more to do today, about 68 degrees, perfect riding weather.